greeting subscribers and other curious persons. As my attempt to vlog every day for a month proved, the biggest issue I face vlogging is coming up with topics that I actually want to talk about on video that I can think of enough to say about to be worth doing at the same time as I've actually got time to record one, which can take a while because my camera goes a bit wonky sometimes, the sound desynchronizes and I can't get it to match back up again. So I've joined a group that provides topics to deal with the first problem of not being sure what to say. So now all I've got to do is try and record them. So manipulators crossed, that's going to do something. And uh, this week's question is favourite reading places. Well, I carry books everywhere I go. I read on trains, I read on buses, I read in five minutes while waiting for appointments at the dentist. I read during the advert breaks in programmes. So it's probably easier to start off with I don't read when I'm somewhere where it will damage the books. So I don't read in the shower. I don't read where I can't read. So I don't read in perfect darkness. And my least favourite place to read is somewhere I can't get comfortable because irking and jerking gets in the way of actually focusing on the text. But apart from that, I read pretty much everywhere and it's the book that's the favourite bit rather than the specific reading place. Potentially the place that I most enjoy being while I'm reading is on the sofa. But that's not really my favourite place to read so much as my favourite place to be and while I'm there, I tend to read a lot because when I'm on the sofa, the cats come and sit on me. But sometimes they come and sit on me and are very interested in the book. And having this little head pop up over the top of the book and then start bunting it from side to side is really conducive to reading. But it is conducive to enjoyment. So whether that's my favourite place to read or my favourite place to be, which happens to intersect with the fact that I read almost everywhere, I'm not sure. But, uh, other than listing almost everywhere I've ever been, it's the only place that stands out as a particularly good place to read. So that's that one answered. Toodaloo!